Hey, hey, comic book community. Hey, it's Comic Country 1014 coming at you with yet another video. Uh, this is not going to be a haul video. This is going to be, uh, you know, uh, a purchase that I found on eBay uh, for a great price and a book that I had in my collection and happy to have back in my collection and a couple other books that I had in my collection that I'm really happy to have found um, at, at TUNC. Yeah, there's a little story behind it too. I'll get to that when I get to the books. But anyway, let's go ahead and begin this uh, video. The first book I found was the one I found on eBay. And this is Mark Spector Moon Knight 55. Hell yeah, man. CGC graded 9.0. Oh my gosh, man. When I saw this book on eBay listed, oh my gosh. It was listed. <laughs> he had it listed for like, I think it was, was it 45 bucks, I guess, or best offer. I made him an offer of 25 bucks and he took it. So yeah, I took it and it was only like a few bucks shipping. So all I paid 30 bucks for this book right here um, <clears throat> with shipping. And uh, like I said, it's in the new CGC uh, slab case, which I really love. They're really thick and, uh, you know, heavy. Um, they're not as thin as the other ones. But, oh, my gosh, man. Yeah, I'm just happy to have this book again, man. So, like I said, I love Stephen Platt's artwork as well, too. Like I said, I love his anatomy. I love the way he draws his, his male figures. They're just so bulky and ripped up. And all of his details is kind of a little bit like McFarlane a little bit. But, uh, yeah, I just, I'm glad to have this book in my, in my collection again. <clears throat> and the next book I... This is going to be, this is where the story comes in, boys and girls. Yeah, at one of my co-workers, uh, you know, it was, like, happened on Tuesday night. Uh, he saw me out, out on the floor and he goes, hey, Eric, hey, I want, uh, you, I brought some books in. To, you know, I think you might want to go take a look and see what I got. I got some pretty good books. And I'm like, all right. <clears throat> uh, and this is one of the books I had saw there. And I'm like, oh, shit, man. Another book they had there. Tell like, oh, man, what the hell? So I asked him, I go, why are you selling, we getting these books? He said, well, I got laid off. I need to make some rent money. So just, you know, throw me an offer, man. Whatever you, whatever you, uh, you know, whatever you, whatever you, whatever you offer, man, I'll go ahead and I'll take it, man. And I was like, what? Oh, man. I go, all right. So what are you going for this? He just, well, make me an offer. I'm like, all right. I have, what, four bucks on me. He's like, all right. I'll leave it four bucks. I'm like, what? Holy crap. And this is one of the books that I had in my, let me fix this camera. Sorry about that, boys and girls. I forgot to adjust it. There we go. <clears throat> And I was like, what, man? So I had this one in my collection. I already have one already. Uh, this is my second one right here. But, yeah, I love this. I love this uh, homage, homage cover to ASM 15, man. Well, not, I mean, ASM. I mean, Amazing Fantasy 15. <laughs> Amazing Fantasy 15. Yeah, man. So it's a sick cover. But this is the one that I was really, really excited to have back in my collection. And for the price I got it at, I just, uh, you know, I get it. Well, of course, you're, it wasn't. It was kind of a steal for me. But, you know, I don't want to lowball the guy because he's a cool guy. So I know he was down and out. And, uh, you know. I didn't want to shortchange this. New Mutants 98. The first appearance of Deadpool. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I go, look, man, I go, how much the book's worth. And this condition is probably going to go for about 200 250 you know. Um, I'll throw you an offer. I go, I mean, you don't have to take it. He goes, man, just make me an offer. I'm like, all right. I go, 100 bucks. He's like, I go, it's sold, man. I go, 100 bucks for this? Holy crap, I was so excited to get this book in my collection again. And for the price, I, I mean, I think I got a pretty good deal. I mean, the only thing that's wrong with it that I can see is there's like a little small bend right there. I keep on doing it. I don't know why I did it. It's right there. You guys can probably see it right there. Focus. There you go. Yeah, I mean, there's no ticks. The colors are are rich. There's, I mean, there's like no color breaks except for that one you know, uh, crease right there, bottom crease. But I think uh, I'd say if I was having the grade, i uh, give it a grade, I'd say like 8.0, maybe 8.5, maybe. I mean, the pages inside are, of course, not white. They're off-white, but still. Uh, just to just really happy to get this book back in my collection again. Hell yeah, man. Like I said, uh, I didn't want to lowball the guy too much. I probably could have got it for 50 bucks if I wanted to, but like I said, he was he was hurting, you know, and I've been there before, so I just uh, thought I'd throw him 100 bucks, and you know, I, didn't, I wasn't expecting him to take it, but he said, yeah, man, I'll take it. So, well, anyways, boys and girls, this is my video. Um, like I said, it wasn't a haul video. It was just a you know, purchase I had purchased on eBay and then a couple of books I happened to run into, man. So, and got them for a pretty great price. Pretty good deal. So, anyways, boys and girls, have a great weekend. And this Common Country is signing off. All right. Cheers, everybody.